In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the Google Sheets add-on Flubaroo to automatically grade student quizzes. So the first step is to create a quiz using Google Forms, and once you do that, you will go to your student responses and you will see a spreadsheet that looks similar to this. You'll have uh, many more responses, but for this example, I have my BPS training account that took the quiz as my sample student, and then I took the quiz as well as the teacher, and in the first name column, I indicated answer key and the script is going to base uh, the key off of my submission so it's important that you take the quiz designate your um, submission as the answer key and I'm going to show you how that will work the first thing you have to do is actually launch the add-on so you're going to do so by clicking on add-ons and you're going to click get add-ons and from here, if you don't see it, you can search for it over here on the right. But since it's here, I'm going to just click on the plus sign to launch the script. And then I'm going to click Accept. And then the script will be working, and it will be added to the menu. So now I've received the notification that it's ready for me to use. And I can go back to Add-ons, and you'll see Flubaru has been added. And now I can grade the assignment. So I'm going to click on Grade Assignment. The script will be working and now I'm in step one. So the username question will identify my student. That will be most likely your um, student's email addresses and you can automatically collect their usernames when they um, take the quiz. You can have this first name question here as well and this might be helpful when you're transferring grades into your grade book. You'll do it um, by first name if that's convenient for you. And then you can also change the point value of the questions from one to five you could skip grading, but in this case, we are going to grade the assignment. Everything's going to remain at one point. And now I'm going to click on Continue. And in step two, this is very important because this is where you will select the submission that should be used as the answer key. So if you designate um, in your first name field the answer key, it will be easily uh, found. It, your submission will probably be the top one. And so once you've done that, you can select Continue. And now Flubaru is going to grade the assignment. And now I will get a notification telling me that grading has been completed. And a new worksheet is created for me automatically called Grades. And this is a worksheet that contains a grade for each submission as well as a summary of all the grades at the top. And the Grades sheet is not meant to be modified in any way as it can interfere with emailing grades. So if I need to modify the sheet, I will copy it and modify the copy. Then I'm given a tip by this script, which is really helpful to know. The very last row shows the percent of students who got each question correct, with overall low scoring questions highlighted in orange. And also individual students who scored below 70% will appear in red font. This is very helpful because it will allow me to touch base with those students and revisit concepts from the lesson that they may not have fully understood. So now I can click on View Grades. And you'll see this spreadsheet down here was created for me, that separate sheet. And my BPS training student account received a 100%. So that's excellent. And now what I can do is I can go back to my add-ons menu and I can do a couple other things. I can go back into Flubaru and now I can email the grades to my students. Now just imagine if you had 25 student submissions here, you could do this really fast. And I have the option to include a list of questions and scores as well as the answer key. If I chose to do that, I could send them the answer key. Um, and then I could send a custom message. Great job on this quiz. And then I can click continue. The script will work. And it's giving me the notification that one grade was successfully emailed. In your case, it's going to say 25, 27, wherever the case may be. And then you're going to click OK. And one other thing that is, uh, and then, as you can see right here, um, there's an X in that emailed grade uh, row, indicating that that, email, that grade was emailed, which is uh, convenient. And then the other thing I can do is go back into add-ons, and I can go to Flubaru, and I can view a report. And again, uh, it's going to show me a histogram. Everybody did really well. That's great. But if I you know, had grades that were all over the spectrum, I may need to uh, revisit 
the lesson and how I went about teaching it. I could get some really useful feedback here just from this visual, and I could also email a report to myself if I needed to. So that was a quick overview of Fluberu. If you need any help one-on-one, -on -one, please uh, shoot me an email or come down to the help desk to work with me individually. And this is a great way to grade quizzes extremely fast, and it will save you a lot of time and help you become much more efficient. Thanks for watching and hope to work with you soon.